that a plane chartered by Wichita State University has crashed in the Colorado Mountains near Idaho Springs and Silver Plume. And with those fateful words uttered by University President Clark Olberg 25 years ago today, a campus, a city, a nation went into shock. And even a quarter century later, University Vice President James Radigan remembers vividly how those shockwaves spread. Some people were in the middle of this situation. Their lives were disrupted forever. Uh, Families, be, the children became orphans. Parents Rich lost Jackson their maybe their Texas. only child. Costello, I really, I would have to say Reed that once this terrible John thing happened, there was a very poignant response to, to it. Flags flew at half staff. There was a memorial service at then brand new Cessna Stadium, and a few days after the crash, the eight players who survived came home. Then, just weeks later, a second plane crash claimed the entire football team from Marshall University, and something more needed to be done. That something turned out to be the Night of Stars, a nationally televised benefit on the Wichita State campus, hosted by Monty Hall and featuring some of the biggest names in show business. It raised hundreds of thousands of dollars for the families of the victims from both schools, and two of the key organizers were Cakes Martin Umansky and his good friend, Julie Barnathan at ABC. We actually got together, he got together, the largest network that ever had happened. I think we had, I think we had 205 stations all together. Uh, it was over in Hawaii also. It was picked up all over. And uh, it was, for, for that time period, uh, it was a major event. There'd been nothing like that before. Hmm. In addition to the financial support, the event also served as a rallying point, a moment to remember those who were lost, an opportunity for closure. And 25 years later, that process continues to this day. It gives you pause. It gives you a, a sense of appreciation that things are as they are and continue on, that despite the devastated condition we were all in, that you bear up and you suffer that moment. And what comes is a moment like this, a moment to remember.